in the East, game. what do you think about the Bucks? Uh, uh, are they? Are you worried I think about them? The Bucks. Are you worried at all? They play yeah. the Raptors. I'm worried about the Bucks because in late game situations, I still think they don't know. For one, they haven't played that many close games this year anyway. Number one. I think they know it's just Middleton is Middleton. Then that's going to be a, But even still, yesterday, they didn't really... Like, it's just when it's Christ time. It's just like, I don't I don't know. I don't know for the Bucks. Like, that's when they really get tight. And again, they also have it, honestly, to like... Kind of like the Wars a couple years ago. When they, when they used to beat everybody so bad... Yeah. That they didn't even really even get to figure that out. They were just running through teams. They didn't even play too many games. Like, yo, we got to close this game out. You like Giannis playing thirty minutes a night? Yeah, they ain't. They ain't they, yeah, ain't Will like was he, playing forty eight. Yeah, like ain't even like he on the court too many times when it's like winning time. Yeah, so he might not even have experience when it's like, yo, it's winning time right now. We need you know good concise yeah. possessions this time, this time, this time. This. So I'm worried about it from that from that standpoint. Still, when it when like shit gets tight, I still don't know who they go to, and I I don't know if you can go to Giannis. I don't know. I don't know if if you can go to your best player when it gets you know in crunch time, and I think that that could potentially be an issue unless it's in transition. If you can get in transition, obviously you can. Uh, stop I think Giannis. it depends. I think they've been loading up on them really, really heavy, and I think that's what they do against all great big men. So the rest of the pieces around them, you better make your shots. Yeah, but the thing about it is, like, it's not like LeBron. Like you have to triple team Giannis. You didn't really have to triple team LeBron. Yeah, you can but double the thing Bron, about you didn't really have Giannis to tri- is have like to triple team Giannis because he's in the paint. Yeah, but also with Giannis is, do you trust him to be able to create still a skilled bucket? I think there will be points in time, which I've said all year in the playoffs or, you know, when it is crunch time, when Giannis will have to create a skilled bucket. And I still have yet to see evidence of him create a skilled bucket when it really matters. And he's not the greatest free throw shooter. I mean, you saw him airball free throw last night. Now, he's gotten better at it, but he's still not the greatest free throw shooter. So it's like in those situations, you got to get the ball damn into Middleton. And Middleton, if he gonna continue to play in the way that, that he's been playing, with, well, then okay, you good. But that's still a question mark. Yeah. So I'm worried about the from that from from the standpoint of like what happens when it's a a game six or something like. Oh wow, wow. Dame! What happens when it's a game Four six? Four point play from Dame. Dame. I mean, hey, that's 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 why I'm not worried. What happens when it's a game, game six Dame. or something like that? You know, we down two. Yeah. 54 seconds left. Yeah. What do they do? Do they even know what they do? Hmm. Interesting point. Mm. So that, that's, that's, that's the only, but, but, but in that, like, no, nah, I mean, I still think they look fine. I think they got, they, you know, they, they, you know, they, they team back. I still think they're the best team in the East. I think even if they did lose, it would be an upset. I don't think any team has better pieces than them. I think that in theory, they're the best team in the league. Uh, I think the yeah 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 I think the Clippers arguably have better pieces, but it's only if they're all playing and if they're all firing at all cylinders. Which not they, really which this yes, season, not do. really. Yes, do Kawhi Leonard and, and Paul George alone? Is are better PG than really having a better season than Chris Middleton this season? That's an honest, honest opinion. No, he's not. Yeah, but PG and Kawhi combined are better than PG and Middleton. This year, not really. Dead ass. This year, no, they're not. Yeah, but we still got Lou and Trez. And Marcus okay, Morris, we got okay. and Patrick Beverly. Okay, we got Brooke Lopez. Shannon, we got and Joakim Noah. Okay, we and got Visa Zubac. That's fair. Okay, and we, Jermichael Green, who's been playing lights out in the bubble. That's fair. We got Brooke Lopez, who I personally think you could make a great argument for the fact that he should have been the finalist for Defense Player of the Year. If you want to make that argument, you got Brooke Lopez. You got Robin Lopez, who's also a side defender. You got Pat Content. He's been decent. Dante Davicio looks like he's the next friend. Dante man. Divincenzo. Di- Divincenzo, Divincenzo, who looks Dante like Dante Divincenzo, who looks like who he's the next t- Fred Van Vliet heart, sometimes, man. and also the image I have of he's Dante. He's gonna be better than Fred Van Vliet. That's fair. He's a little bit taller, a little that's bit more fair. athletic. And also the image of I have him in of of him in my mind is that next championship game. Remember when that next championship game he had like twenty in the, the first half? Yeah. So he seems like a guy that you know when the when yeah. like the lights is on he might shine. Bright. That's actually why I'm kind of mad. Uh, Blesso is back because I think he's gonna take a lot of shots away from Divincenzo and I. I actually like DiVincenzo getting the opportunity to be able to score, but yeah. I don't mind that. I was watching the game yesterday, like I wish they would put George Hill in. And I hope that Coach Bud doesn't like he did last year 
stuck with Bledsoe when it's like, get Bledsoe off the floor, G. There were times in the rap series, I'm like, yo, Bledsoe is yeah. unplayable. Get him off the court, G. Yeah. Put in George Hill. Please put in George Hill. But I think he does it because defensively. I don't know who that's off. You got to jump all that. <laughs> but I think he does because defensively, he gives you a, a couple more options than what George Hill does because he's bigger. Yeah. Stronger. Yeah. Interesting. So let's round this out. Champagne, 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 champagne.